And uh, no, you're not seeing things around town here. Gas prices really are under six dollars mm -hmm. across the county. They're moving down. Wow. So look at this right here. The average price for a regular gallon of gas is five ninety eight. Now I remember when that was our headline for being really high, <laughs> uh, but you know things are changing. Last week the average price was six fifteen. So what is causing prices to go down? CBS 8's Chris Grow joining us live from yet another gas station. So what's the very latest here? Eric Neto, I, I have to show you this because I'm old enough to remember the last time that $4.99 for a gallon of regular gas was thought to be expensive when you were shopping around town to try to find even cheaper than that. But here in El Cajon, that's probably one of the cheaper prices that you are going to find throughout all of San Diego County. Now, a lot of people wondering how long this is going to happen and a lot of people wondering why this is happening. Well, according to Gas Buddy, who we had a pretty thorough conversation about the topic with, they said it's actually inflation that's causing these gas prices to go down. Now, it's a little bit more complicated than that, but yes, inflation and the actions taken by the Federal Reserve, like raising interest rates, are limiting the oil demand. That means that prices for the average gallon of gas will go down. So essentially, raising uh, those interest rates, that is going to act like throwing cold water on a hot fire. Now, that it will hold, according to them, so long as a refinery doesn't shut down or a natural disaster doesn't happen, like a hurricane. And according to Gas Buddy, that means that the odds are in our favor that prices will continue to go down. Fairly unusual, in fact, uh, historically relevant, one of the largest declines we've seen in quite some time, certainly one of the top declines we've seen in the last decade, really kind of rivaling the decline that we saw during COVID. Now, of course, prices are not as low as they were during COVID, but the declines are starting to get to the point where they're getting closer. Yeah, so it's it's not the greatest news, right? But it's good news. It means that we are seeing prices go down. We've reached 29 consecutive days. It's very likely we are going to see 30 and even beyond that. In fact, the average price of gal of a gallon of gas, of regular gallon of gas right now, is the lowest that it's been since May 16th.